here we are going to discuss a very key point i have kept it separate from other modules because it is of an immense important element here it is called diversification that's kind of backbone of financial risk management that is to learn about diversification when i say diversify that i mean to spread your investment spread where that if you are investing in stock rather than investing in one it is better to invest in two if you are investing in two it's better to invest in five the more the number of scripts the more diversified your portfolio and imperial study empirical studies have identified that if you reach a number of 30 stocks that can be referred to as a well diversified stock portfolio which doesn't mean we can only stay till 30 it can go to any number but 30 is a fairly decent number to get the desired level of diversification but if you have seen this point i have not discussed anything other than shares so that means it's still risky to a one particular category we call it asset class so we have spread into many shares but the asset class is same that is equity so another better version could be if we spread it among different asset classes when i say asset class it is a categorization of financial instruments based on their risks and their dynamics and their properties for example agar main baat karu jaise shares stocks ki baat hogi isse achhi diversification kya hogi ki kuch paise main shares mein dalu kuch paise main bonds mein dalu ab rather than dono mein ek share ek bond lu main kuch shares le lu kuch bonds le lu isse bhi acha portfolio kaise ho sakta hai we can invest in real estate or any other category of asset so diversification is a key i'll keep this topic brief because you can give importance and weightage to this point so let's learn how do you think this portfolios can be it's a i've just made a illustration for you portfolio a we have shares of mcb theoretically speaking it is a very good investment because it's one of the prime leading bank having a very strong base and we invest all our money in this particular share visibly it seems to be a good investment but for finance professional it is not because it is risking a lot of your money in a one particular institute so let's if you look at down then we have spread spread our investment in three categories mcb nbp allied bank again very good portfolio have leading banks of the country but again not a very good portfolio why sare bank hai isme mcb bhi national bank bhi allied bank bhi agar banking sector ko koi cheez aati hai affect karti hai ya state bank ko aisa strict rule le aata hai to then our portfolio will be losing a lot now look at another possible way we have mcb we have nishat mills and we have dg khan cement very good portfolio theoretically bank textile company and cement company my answer would be again no it's not a very good why just think about it because all three companies belong to one group of companies that is nishat mills so that mean their connection or their main sponsors are same so if something happens to that particular sponsor then all these portfolio will get affected so moving down now we have mcb we have some lucky cement and we have sapphire textile now in this out of these categories i'll call it the best portfolio reason being mcb banking sector from one group of companies lucky cement stock and from entirely different group of company and then we have a sapphire textile mill a entirely different sector so this way we can see our portfolio is diversified but again that high level of diversification is not yet achieved that would achieve when we insert in more asset classes like bonds like commodities like real estate and any other investment that was available to us so famous statement is there never put all your eggs in one basket 
इसका मतलब क्या है कि आपके पास सपोजिटली जितने भी एसेट्स हैं वो आपने एक जगह पार्क कर दिए और अगर उस बास्केट को कुछ हो गया जैसे उस अंडों की बास्केट को कुछ हो गया तो सारे अंडे खत्म इसी तरह आपकी इन्वेस्टमेंट के साथ भी यही होगा अगर आपने सारे पैसे एक ही जगह लगा दिए तो यू कैन लूज अलॉट तो अब हमें क्या करना है वी नीड टू डाइवर्सिफाई वो कैसे करेंगे स्प्रेड इन डिफरेंट एसेट क्लासेस स्प्रेड इन डिफरेंट एसेट पहले डिफरेंट क्लासेस जाएं फिर उनके अंदर भी डिफरेंट बॉन्ड्स में जाएं अगर बॉन्ड की क्लास है तो मल्टीपल बॉन्ड्स खरीदें एक पेल का ले लें एक एम का ले लें फिर किसी और कंपनी का ले लें एंड देन डू इट तो दिस विल बी रेफर टू एज डाइवर्सिफिकेशन वी शुड लर्न इट बाय हार्ट बिकॉज दैट इज गोइंग टू बी लिंक्ड विद अदर टॉपिक्स एज वेल थैंक यू